kilo junior world champion, the reigning and the national runner-up in Sean Jin and his coach, Jaron Yamei. So do you want to make an opening statement and coach if you want to brag on your lifter a little bit? <laughs> Um, I mean, this was a crazy opportunity for me to be able to do this in the first place. Uh, I mean, I thought initially that Gruden was going to have the edge on me. And, you know, at the end of the day, we have no clue what's, what the hell is going to happen. So I try to play my cards right. It was almost there, but it is what it is. So I'll take it. Yeah. And uh, from a coaching standpoint, super happy, super proud of Sean. Uh, we're able to walk away with uh, squat PR. So 300, first 300 squat, uh, bench PR, 195. And uh, we went for a huge deadlift PR and super, super close. Uh, 825 and a half would have been a 30.5 30 kilo meat PR. or Yeah, 30.5 yeah, kilo. Or, or 27 20, and a half. Yep. 27 and a half kilo. 28, sorry. 28 kilo PR. Yep. And then deadlift would have been a, I believe, a 15, 17 and a half kilo mm -hmm. PR um, yeah. from uh, last comp. So. so, yeah, just insane day. Um, super, super happy with his performance. I mean, despite the, the miss on the third, like we we're talking about it and just very happy, you yeah. know, very happy and happy that we went for it too. No regrets. Yeah. All right, back here. Yeah, first of all, congratulations on your performance. Um, you're known as somebody who competes extraordinarily well and makes a lot of lifts, and that's kind of your calling card, I think. No. Um, was there ever a thought in your mind? I mean, I know kind of this Carpino was looming for the lifters. Was there ever a thought in your mind when – when Gruden missed a couple benches and that kind of tightened the totals a little bit, was there ever a thought that, okay, maybe I'll just go for the W as opposed to the Carpino? I think for us specifically, because we know how Sheffield is probably going to play out and stuff, it wasn't really in our favor for us to kind of just go for the win. Um, most likely, the five spots are going to be taken, or sorry, six spots are going to be taken by, you know, all the folks in Sheffield. So uh, it doesn't make any sense for me to kind of just play by. Uh, the year so I mean there might there might be even more like seven eight who knows um so just full sent it yep yeah and uh we actually touched bases on that right before deadlifts so like going into the meet you know we're touching bases okay if this happens uh what number do we want to take if this scenario plays out what number do we want to take and after bench we're like okay we're leading now I think on projected totals uh at the start of the meet we were behind by maybe Seven and a half. I like, think. yeah, we were behind on projected totals. And then um, after squat, we were behind, I think, by 10 kilos. But after bench, we were ahead by 10 kilos. And I was like, okay, you know, if we play this right, uh, our opener is heavier than, than John's. So we can just kind of go above his and we can secure the win. But say in the case, uh, you know, we make our second and John puts in his third and he gets it to tie our total and beat us on body weight. Uh, you know, like, what do you want to do? Do you want to take a small jump and secure the win? Or are we going uh, 330 and a half for, for 825 and a half? And he was just no doubt. He was like, yeah, we're going 825 and a half for sure. Um, especially if he was going to be feeling strong on the day. Like, that's what we we're going to do. And from, like, warm-ups, we we're like, yeah, we're, we're fucking on. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> sorry like, we, but we were on. He was like, yeah, we're on. And especially after his second attempt, he was like, load it. It's definitely there. So, yeah. Just only squat, I believe. Um, um, I wish, you know, like I had a couple injuries like a while back uh, with the cot strain and then also my pec uh, keeps coming back and forth and stuff. So, uh, you know, prep could have gone a little bit better. Maybe we could have gone on like a better projected total, but, you know, I had to de deal with whatever cards I got. So. Sean, you looked really happy today. Like you really having fun out there. And um, I know the result isn't really what you were looking for, but, you know, what's next for you? Uh, well, we'll see how Sheffield plays out, um, how that happens, and uh, I gotta see what meets are available next, so, yeah. Well, hopefully, you know, if uh, the Open World team doesn't work out, we'll see you in the Cayman Islands on the NAPF team. All right. All right, that's it for Sean Jin. Thank you awesome. so much for coming in. Cool. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Yeah, of course.